Pretty sure there's worse ways to wake up than this. Day two. Not the best sleep last night. The train was rocking through. And last time we were here, we didn't notice. Beer and juice sleeps are, um, they have their place in this world. Good morning. How you doing? I'm not awake. How you, Branson? Oh, how you, Bran? Wah, 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 wah. I just want to go back to bed, but he wouldn't let me sleep because he needed to pee, and he won't pee in our campsite. He's like, I'm always thinking of you guys, aren't you, Bron? He looks like he's game on. Bron, do you want to come to the gym with me? Yeah, I do. But look at this place, huh, this morning. Uh, it's freaking lovely. Was that stupid? There's the train. It's like they, they all know it's campground, so like they're like, okay, let's start blasting with the horn. I know, and the stupid sign that when you're entering the, the campground specifically says, this train does not have a horn. <laughs> it does. Gotcha! Place is practically brand new. All mine, it looks like today. Nice free weights room. So I've got the whole place to myself. This is sweet. It's the best part about working out in a new gym like this. All the new machines you can play with. New toys. That place is deserted, but 20 past seven. Yeah, it's a great, great spot. The Wave, Whitefish, Montana. <clears throat> Shout out again to the boys from the Wave. It's a great gym for a small town. Super friendly staff. $15 for two day entry. Can't be so, ba so bad, you know. Let's get back to camp, get some breakfast. Get the show on the road. It's a lovely day, holy, look at that. Sunshine and lollipops. Just pop it in for it into Safeway to you, uh, get the coffee, get the tea, and we come across, uh, I guess, the right way to do the camping these days. And that is, check it out, that is one, I think it's a cheap SRT, one badass camper. Holy cozy. Good official morning, guys. I am finally awake for real this time. Um, it's about nine o'clock. Um, I came back and went to sleep. <laughs> Uh, Branson's here with me. Say hi, bud. <laughs> He's finally awake as well. Um, yeah, so as you can see, I'm still bundled up. <laughs> I literally just got up and uh, we're getting ready to start this day. I'm gonna go put a fire on and heat up some breakfast. And yeah, Wayne should be back soon too. So we will see you guys shortly. Wayne is back and he brought me tea. I'm so excited. That's the one thing we don't have is anything to make like coffee or tea first thing in the morning. So the fact that he has brought me tea both mornings. Oh, some people might say that that's not camping. I don't care. You cannot deny someone their caffeine. Going up to Whitefish Trail for a hike now. Happy days. <laughs> Loading up on supplies for the hike. And I'm having orange juice now. Do you remember how to open it? Yes. <laughs> Rock and roll. Hike, oh. hike, hike, hike. Going on a hike. Much better lighting. <laughs> it's a good side. It is my good side. All right, we are at the hike. Bronson's ready to go. Wayne's ready to go. Where are we going? We're going. Lion Mountain. Yes. Lion Mountain, it's like an out, uh, a lookout. There's actual lions up there too. Oh my goodness. Maybe there are mountain lions though. Yeah. You never know. No, anyway, we're going to find out. Let's go. It's going to be like this all the way. It's going to be handy. I know. This is like a good trail so far. It's not crazy. Star Fox. I wonder what that's all about. Weird. Comment below. What do you think the shovel is for?
probably go a little far. That's about you? No, oh, not bad at all. Oh, <laughs> uh, I just went up to the lookout. Oh yeah? Yeah. Not so far? No, it's like a three miles round trip, so probably another mile and a half for you. Nice. Oh, nice. Perfect. Nice. Brooks, come on. <laughs> Bye, Brian. Bye, Brian. Hope you find your dad. <laughs> Stopping for a water break. Oh. Want some water, Brian? Cool. I'm just gonna get all over you. Teach your dog how to drink out of a water bottle. <laughs> Good? Come on. Onwards. We made it! <laughs> yes, we did. So where's the overlap? Oh no, wait. we still have a little bit to go. We're here. Oh yeah, look, it says, look. And there's like a little mini loop to get to the actual lookout. Sweet. Sweet. Let's keep going then. Bronson knows the way. Actually, guys, I've been here before. Oh yeah, look, there's like a bench and everything. Oh, it is a really nice lookout. Sorry, would you like to pass? Look at that. That's crazy. Bronson. Oi, you don't go. Come here. Here, hey. <laughs> when you're dry and you can't whistle. <laughs> Holy. Yeah, there's gonna be no shadows, right? Yeah. We could maybe uh, leash him. What do you think, hon? I think I'm going to sit here for 20 minutes and take it all in. Yeah. It's lovely. It's nice. I think Bronson's right there with you in the shade. Yeah. <laughs> you sitting down for the day? You might be, uh, might just say hello to the dogs first. Just for the dogs <gasps> oh, look at friends. Hello. Oh, is he good? Next one is, he might be good. Oh, here. What dog is that? He's a Great Dane crossed with an English Mastiff. Yeah, that's a good looking dog. <laughs> He's a handsome boy, huh? Yeah, he is, no doubt. We're lucky. You want another one? <laughs> what do you think? You liking the view? Not the worst, I guess, eh? Hi, beautiful boy. I want to go to the lake. <laughs> Sorry, Bronson. <laughs> it's been decided. And I'm pretty pumped about it, but <laughs> frozen yogurt. <laughs> sheet meal is on the way. Yeah, since it's like a frozen yogurt and coffee place. Yeah. All right, I'm hoping they have like iced tea. That'd be really good too, like a lemon iced tea. Cold brew. <laughs> Cold brew. Okay, here's my rant of the day, guys. Uh oh. Yeah. Do it. Cold brew. It's just iced coffee, but all of a sudden, cold brew is like the new thing. It's just and cool. And it's like as if it's like a brand new thing, like it just came out this summer. It's nothing different than iced coffee that has been here for years. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand how people are like so excited that like, oh, cold brew is. We gotta available. go for cold brew. Do you want to go for a cold brew? Like it just. In, in, you in just a, changed the name of it and all of a sudden it's a brand new thing. In that jar? What's the jar it's called? In a mason jar. In a mason jar. Like they just made it more hipster. Yeah, hipster, and, hipster coffee and just then took it was another... like, bam, this is a new product. Yeah. When iced coffee has been around for how long? I don't know. Anyway, rant over. <laughs> I don't understand people. <laughs> <laughs> Frozen yogurt! Woo! <laughs>
Okay, so now that I can actually kind of see me and talk, I got the cookies and cream frozen yogurt with cake batter on top of that, Oreo crumble, gummy worms, gummy bears, and sprinkles. Did not go for the healthy option in any way possible, shape, or form, and I'm okay with that. Oh, yeah? Oh, really? Yeah. They have cold Give me a crazy pump of my friggin' calves are holy moly. Sugar. It's tasty, tasty. Here's one we made earlier. <laughs> Only in the States. Is that road worthy? <laughs> Look at it. Like, it's taped literally together. taped together. He doesn't even have a back windshield. The whole thing is lopsided. Oh my god. As long as he has a snowboard gear, he is a happy chappy, obviously. Which way? Right or left? I can't remember. Uh, left. Bye. Getting the dinner on. I am going to be having some chicken, coleslaw, pita bread. What, what's, what's in there? Pepperoni, salami, cheese, and marinara sauce. Ooh. My weird, taste buds are a little bit weird at the moment, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> you live? Bronson. Alive. Okay, good. What do we got here? It's like steak fajita without the fajita. Wayne picked up these chips. Pop chips. Tangy barbecue. See how they taste. Gluten free and hipster approved. They're like very thick. Oh, they're nice. 
but yeah, good and that bad. Not bad, but do you so say do you say so myself? Mm. Hmm. Pop chips. Find them in a grocery store near you. Uh, Stephanie put these guys together like a pita pizza. Uh, pepperoni and uh, pita bread and, and marinara sauce and a bit of cheese and I can put my chicken in this guy. Because we got so much food and we don't know what to do with it except try and eat some of it. Aren't you pops? Camping style. <laughs> I know, yeah. Oh, but you want like a sharp knife, don't Yeah, you? this will actually cook. <laughs> Camping in style right there. Steak fajitas. Yummy. I think it's just my taste buds are dictating. I'm gonna wrap it over oh. and down the hatch. <laughs> You'll put anything into a sandwich, won't you? Yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> Texture, crunchiness, coldness, awesomeness. Mmm. Really good. Okay. It's like a taco. It is kind of like a chicken pizza taco. Need more coleslaw. <laughs> I'm gonna do another one of these. This is so good. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. Would you, would you mind popping on another pizza pocket for me? If you go camping and you don't roast a marshmallow, did you really go camping? <laughs> that is like the perfect golden. Ooh. That is like the perfect golden marshmallow. Look at that. Delicious. There's all good. This is my third one. <laughs> I'm just popping them back. Well, that's just about it for the camping weekend. We're strolling back down to camp now. Yeah, it's been a great couple of days. Really relaxing. Got to see a bit, hike a bit, eat a bit. <laughs> but yeah, back to the Great White North. Ready to hit the road. We on the road early in the morning. Yeah. So we'll catch you later. See you tomorrow, guys. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> 6.15, packed up the camp and we're ready to hit the road. It's uh, so early. It is early. Came down for one last look at the at the lake. It's such a nice morning. It is a beautiful morning. As the guy with the bumper sticker said yesterday, welcome to Montana, take your pictures and leave. Batcher's about to go. So we're going to hit the road. We'll see you on the flip side. And yeah, don't forget to, well, if you got this far, <laughs> smash, smash that thumbs up button and give us a like. Yeah, and don't forget to share and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Last year when we were heading home, we went through Glacier National Park. Uh, it's a little bit longer drive home, but you get to go on this um, this crazy highway. It's called like, Going to the Sun Highway. Um, but basically, it's a famous road through Glacier National Park. It takes you up like a huge amazing mountain. You're on like the side of the mountain the entire time. It's regarded as one of the best, best scenic drives mm. in the world that you can take, and it is it's it, it's mind blowing. So if you're ever in the area, check it out. Go see it. Take your photos. Be terrified as you drive it. It's wonderful. It's, it's worth it. It's yeah. really worth it. That um, and the frozen yogurt down here. Totally <laughs> worth it. Yes. Go to the Red Caboose. That was amazing. <laughs> it was so good. Highly recommended. All right. That's it. See you later, guys.